Hey, good afternoon guys, John with New York Metro Weather. Hope you're doing well, happy Friday. I hope you're watching this video from outside and if you're not, go outside and watch it from outside. It's an amazing day. Uh, northerly flow coming down, beautiful skies this afternoon, just a couple clouds out there. Temperatures are very manageable and most importantly, the dew points are extremely manageable today. Looking at uh, this morning and into this afternoon, we're in the 40s and 50s, which just feels unbelievable. Uh, nice warm sun throughout the day today. So very little complaints, except for the fact that a little bit of wildfire smoke will make its way into the sky uh, as we go through the afternoon. It's very elevated, meaning it's several thousand feet above our head. It's not down near the surface. But you will notice a little bit of haze. Uh, and a little bit of a milky look to the sky as opposed to that really crystal clear blue sky that we would normally have. So um, not a totally perfect day, but very, very, very close to it. Now, as we move through the weekend, we expect much of the same on Saturday. The dew points will be a bit higher, though. So let's roll this forward here to Saturday afternoon. So it's in the 50s, uh, but you start to see a little bit of a dew point climb and a wind shift as we go through Saturday. Temperatures will be a little warmer, still sunny. The wildfire smoke is out. But the dew points are climbing a little bit by Saturday afternoon and evening, making it feel a little bit warmer. And then on Sunday, you start to notice a more substantial change. By Sunday uh, afternoon, the dew points are back into the mid-60s. And all of a sudden, this air mass starts to feel warmer because we're losing that northerly flow, that beautiful cool air that we have right now. So what's the reason for that? Here's where we are right now. This is the remnants of Idalia. It's going to swing way out to sea, not going to bother us. And our area is going to be caught uh, away from this system and initially in a nice air mass but as we get into sunday and monday we're starting to come under the, the the service of this huge ridge that builds in the central united states and what's going to happen is temperatures are going to increase significantly here's the temperature departure from normal today actually a couple degrees below normal but if we roll this forward to sunday and then monday and tuesday of next week the map just continues to look worse and worse. And as we get into the middle part of next week, we're already uh, about 10 degrees warmer than normal. So we could be looking at a late season heat event at some point during the early to middle part of next week. We can actually look at this probabilistically and pull up what the chances are that the temperature will be over 90 on a given day. And just as an example, here's Wednesday. Those are pretty high probabilities. We're talking about 70 or 80% chance that we're hitting 90 degrees uh, during the, this upcoming week. So all the more reason to get out there today. It's going to get hotter and humid next week. We have a beautiful afternoon on tap. Nearly perfect out there today. Beautiful Saturday. Beautiful Sunday, getting a little warmer and humid, and then Monday, probably the hottest day of the weekend. No precipitation to worry about, but we will warm up as we go through the next couple of days. I hope you guys have a wonderful Labor Day weekend. Enjoy the time off, and most importantly, get out there. It's a beautiful day. I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care.